Hello and welcome, and today for some fun, we're going to open up some magic card packs. The newest set, Aether Revolt. And just for fun as well, we're going to open up one Oath of the Gatewatch. Let's have some fun. Box of Adventure! For kids! Alright, I have a fat pack of Aether Revolt. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's a box. Kind of a neat little insert. We have the player's guide, which tells you all about the cards. Look at that tremendously wonderful art. Isn't that great? Wow, and all the different cards. Let's see what we can find today. There's the box. We'll put all of our cards in the box, and look, there's another box inside of the box. That's great. A green dice. They call this a life counter. Isn't that neat? Oh, look at that symbol. Alright, we're going to set that over here. We have all these lands for which to play with. And, oh, look at all those packs. Okay, looks like we have, oh, and a play mat, quick reference guide, and all these packs. I wonder which one we'll get the good cards in. I'm hoping we get good cards. Are you hoping we get good cards? Let's start with this. Here we go. Now, of course, with these packs, we like to look quickly at the commons. Then we'll get to the uncommons and we'll show them to you. Uncommon. Uncommon. Uncommon and here comes our rare. <sighs> Scrap trawler. And a land. And a servo. Okay. Let's see what the next ones are. Let's put our, put our rares right here for us to see. And we'll put our uncommon stack here. All right. Let's see what we have next. Okay. Look at all these neat commons. They always have such great art. Treasure Keeper. Invigorated Rampage. Monstrous Onslaught. And our rare is Release the Gremlins. Kind of fun. Release the gremlins. And oh, it looks like we have a reserve card and our land and a foil card. That's always neat. Oh, they're automaton. That's a pretty foil, isn't it? Well, let's see what our next card is. Okay, here we go. There's our uncommon Savage Scuttler, Tesseract's Touch, Siege Modification, and our rare is Shram's Expertise. Do you play white? This help you? Create 311 colorless servo artifact creature tokens. Wow, that's pretty neat. You may cast a card with a converted mana cost of three or less from your hand without paying its mana cost. Wow, that's pretty cool. And a land, and of course a servo. Look at those lands, those are kind of neat. All right, here's another one. Let's see what we get. There's Chandra, the one we want, but that's kind of fun. All right, let's go through these. Whoosh, Iron Trick Crusher. Uncommon. Dead Eye Harpooner. Daredevil Dragster. <laughs> Consulate Dreadnought. And a rare. <gasps> Yaheni Undying Partisan. Haste 2 2. 
looks like lots of fun and it's a vampire and we have that and a swamp all right let's see what our next one is Go. And an uncommon salvage scuttler again. Consulate dreadnought again. Perilous predicament. That looks pretty pretty mean. Oh, each opponent sacrifices an artifact creature and a non-artifact creature. Wow. And our rare, Pia's Revolution. Revolution! Servo and a Plains. Plains are fun. Okay, so that was from that stack. I wonder what we might be able to get from the next stack. Let's look. Here we go. Okay, this is from the Fat Pack. Let's see what we get from the fat pack that might be good. Here we go. Iron Tread Crusher again. Okay, we are... Oh, and an Ornithopter. I've always liked Ornithopters. Those have always been fun to play with. And Foundry Hornet. Barricade Breaker. And our rare is... Kari Zev, Skyship Raider. It's a human pirate one three for two. That's kind of fun for Strike Menace. You create a legendary two one red monkey creature token. <laughs> That's pretty neat. All right, and a gremlin. And a forest. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Still looking for some mythics. Mythics would be nice. Foil rare, foil mythic would be good, and of course, the legendary creatures are kind of fun. But let's see what else we can get here. Oh, okay. Oh, there's something. There's a foil in there. I saw it glistening. Did you see that? Pretty cool. Let's see what we got going on. So we got a restoration specialist, treasure keeper. Servo schematic and our rare is ooh, it's a land. That's a spire of industry. Gives you one colorless to your mana pool, or you can pay a life and one mana of any color to your mana pool. Activates the ability only if you control an artifact. And our foil is an uncommon hidden stockpile. That's kind of pretty. Look at that. And our mountain and a servo. So not bad. That's a pretty good one. Let's see what we have next. Alright. Here we go. Whoa, there we have. Look at that. Look at these cards. These are great. This is a fun set. Dead Eye Harpooner. And Winkin Raiders, Felidar Guardian, and the rare, a Walking Ballista. 2x, wow. Walking Ballista enters the battlefield with x plus 1 plus 1 counters on it. And then you can put plus 1 plus 1 counters, or you can deal damage by removing them. Swamp and Energy. Alright, let's see what's next. Let's go through these. There we are. Shielded Aether Thief. Efficient construction. Airdrop Aeronauts and our rare. <gasps> ah, yeah, Henny's Expertise. All creatures get minus one, minus one until end of turn. You may cast a card with converted mana cost three or less from your hand without paying its mana. Yeah, kind of neat. Island. And eh, not much there. Let's see what the next one is. Still waiting for that, that wonderful 
mythic. Maybe it'll be a foil mythic. Wouldn't that be something? Okay. There's an uncommon. Invigorated Rampage. Wow. Ooh, there is a foil in here. <laughs> Untethered Express. Siege modification. And our rare is a Metallic Mimic. That's a great card. Enters the battlefield. You choose a creature type. And the Mimic is the chosen type in addition to its other types. And each other creature control with the chosen type enters the battlefield with an additional plus one, plus one counter on. And our foil, it's a pretty foil. It's not a rare, but it is pretty verdant automaton. Look at that. And you can make it bigger. And another servo. All right, still no mythics. Well, sometimes it happens that way, you know? Got three foils. Got a land. An automaton, which is kind of fun. All right. Let's see what else we get. All right, we have Weld Fast Engineer, Renegade Wildsmith, Hungry Flames, and Scrap Trawler. And comes in uh, whenever Scrap Trawler or another artifact you control is put into the graveyard from the battlefield. Return to your hand, target artifact card in your graveyard with lesser converted mana cost. That'd be a fun card to play. It only costs three for a three-two, which is pretty decent. All right. Let's see what we got. What do we have? We have our first uncommon renegade. Renegade Rall Rallier. <laughs> Ridge scale Tusker. Five, five for five. Mm. Plus, plus one, plus one counter in each creature you control. That's pretty good. And our rare, Baral's Expertise. That could be kind of fun. And Gremlin. Turn up to three target artifacts and or creatures to your owner's hand. Or to their owner's hand. They may cast a card with converted on a cost of four or less from your hand without paying for it. Ooh. That's kind of neat. Kind of a double cast. I like that. Yeah. I could see play, definitely. Especially in returning stuff. And, uh, I can see there could be some sneaky, sneaky stuff going on there. Sorry I haven't opened anything spectacular for you, but you, know, you keep trying. This is kind of fun to see what we have. Okay, there's one. Grifted Aetherborn. Another Renegade, and Pima Aetherseer, and, <laughs> what do you know, another Spire of Industry. Kind of crazy, two of them, but that sometimes happens. All right, got two of these left, and then we're going to open the Oath of Gatewatch and see if we can get something good out of there. And an Ornithopter, another Ornithopter, another Consulate Dreadnought, 7-Eleven, look at that. Tezrex Touch, and another Walking Ballista. Hmm. Couple of each, huh? Okay, well, here we are. Last pack. Not one single Mythic. Oh well, it happens. Sometimes. Some interesting cards, but that's what happens. All right, well, we got another Ornithopter, Barricade Breaker, Fatal Push. That's kind of a neat little card, and another Yaheni's Expertise. Wow, that was an unusual attack. Look, that is uh, interesting to get two of those, two Ballistas. Wow. 
Okay, well, here we are. Very in. Oath of Gatewatch. Why not? It's kind of fun. Let's see what we have. We'll just go quickly through here. Yeah, Crumbling Vestige, Hedron Crawler, Cyclone Devour and Flames, and Ruin in their wake. Seagate Wreckage. Yes, it is, but I got a full art land. Seagate Wreckage. We'll put that there. Put these here. Alrighty. No mythics. Couple of doubles. Couple of lands. One mimic. That's kind of fun. A few legendary creatures. This would be neat to play with. I hope you enjoyed watching it. I enjoyed opening these packs for you. And join us again. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you so much for joining us. Don't forget to hit that like button. Check out all of our other wonderful videos. And remember, if you haven't already, please subscribe.